friends, have you tried color changing vinyl for cups yet? That's what we're doing today. Let's get into it. Okay, so let's start out on the craft table. So I have this color changing vinyl. Um, it's permanent, which means I'm gonna be able to wash it and not worry about it coming off. And this darling little tumbler, and they come in a ton of colors. And I got both of these at Hobby Lobby and on sale, by the way. Let's pop into Cricut Design Space and I'll show you what we're making. So I really wanted a new insulated tumbler, um, perfect for hiking and running. And so I have grabbed this design, the Great Outdoors. I love this, it's so cute. And before we got going, I measured the front of my tumbler and made this little template. I like to do this because it helps me to know my area um, when I'm putting my designs on, especially if I'm adding multiple things and not just one element like this is. So then I'm just gonna turn off that template and now I know I have the right size to cut. And we're gonna cut with our Cricut Joy today. We'll just connect our machine, choose on the mat, and now we can see that this works perfectly with the smaller uh, four and a half by six and a half mat. And now we wanna choose our material. Don't just choose vinyl, make sure that you go down and specifically choose heat, cold, activated color changing vinyl. And now we're ready to cut. Okay, and so now back on the craft table, we're going to cut out our material. Just notice that cold activated material like this um, is glossy. And so we just want to cut out the piece that we need. We're gonna pop that onto the mat and then we are going to cut. I like to use a brayer just to make sure I get all the bubbles out. Here we go. Okay, and the cut looks good. Let's weed it. Okay, so now let's use transfer tape and we'll pick up our design. I like to use a brayer with intricate cuts just to make sure that I'm getting between all of the elements and I'm able to pick it up really easy. Peel from the edges and we'll just pick up that design. Then we'll use the taco method to place it onto our tumbler working from the middle out. And I use that brayer again just to make sure I get in between all of the elements. I think it turned out really great and even if you didn't get any color changing out of this, this permanent vinyl I think is absolutely darling. But let's go ahead and give it a whirl. We'll put some ice in our cup. Now this is an insulated cup. If you wanted immediate reaction I would say use glass. But see, it's already starting to turn. So from pink to purple, the material itself just needs to get down to 50 degrees and then it'll start changing colors. So just to recap, if you are wondering what is different from regular vinyl to color changing vinyl, there's not much guys. It literally cuts the same, the process is the same. You need to choose that color changing vinyl in your Cricut back end, but you can use any of the Cricut machines to cut it as well. So I hope that you will stick around and craft with me in my next video. See you there.